Hey guys, MechanicCG here and welcome back to another episode of Assassin's Creed Origins. Today is episode number... I'm trying to remember. Number 7, it's been a while. Um, and apparently, um, I asked a, a couple of you guys in the Discord. Um, apparently fast travelling is only possible by synchronising your location in these lookout places by the looks of it. Um, I don't know, where do I have to go? Do I have to go up here? Yes. Here we go, synchronize. Wow. That looks amazing. Wow, Icarus's perception increased. Oh my gosh, that is amazing. Oh look, there he is. Speak of the devil. Oh. Oh, it's just fast travelled us here. Uh, maybe not. Right, so I'm here at the uh, blacksmith at the moment. He's just over here. Here he is. Uh, and what we're going to do is we are going to... I think what I'm going to do, I'm going to up, uh, upgrade Nikolaus's sword. Shit, that cost a lot. Uh, so now that is level 9. I probably should have waited. Because we're about to hit level 10. But what we can do now is we can engrave it. Uh, with a extra ability. So we can do 3% uh, damage with swords. 4% uh, poison damage, 2% hunter, 4% fire, or extra adrenaline. Mm. I'm going to go 4% poison. Amazing. Um, I'm also going to sell all of the crap that I have. Uh, I'm going to sell this one. Um, I should probably put the wolf's helmet on as well. Uh, I'll leave the wolf's helmet for... Oh, I can't even upgrade it anyway, so it's fine. 5% headshot damage would be good for um, hitting people with the bow and arrow, which I am about to upgrade right now. Where are you? Here we go. Bows. 5% headshot damage. Oh, actually. Go for that one. Stop by again. Um, let's quickly chuck that on. Uh, what's in here? I don't have a clue what half of this stuff is. Uh, those are spears. Um, what I'm going to do off camera, I want to actually get back uh, the Ubisoft Club armor because it actually looked really good so I'm going to upgrade that armor but oh, wow look at that helmet um so what we're going to do we're going to head over to the mission now uh I'll see where are you here you are right let's run over here right we are over, uh, we are to speak with the Oracle of Delphi. So I'm guessing we're in the Sanctuary of Delphi. Yeah, that makes sense. Um, so somewhere we need... There's actually a synchronization point here. So... Can we jump up here?
Ah, there it is. Synchronization. I'm pretty sure that statue would break with our weight, but it's just a game. Oh, there's a stadium there. That's quite cool. And there we go. Fast travel unlocked. And Icarus's perception has been increased. Oh dear. Oh, uh, is it towards the side? Yes. Is it? Or towards the back? Here it is. We're so close to the gods, I can feel Apollo all around me. How did it go with Elpinon? We can talk later in private. Who's this? Just a simple pilgrim. He just saw the oracle. I couldn't help but ask if she's as glorious as they say. Well, is she? She left me with more questions than answers. That's the oracle for you. may have mentioned you. <laughs> Think before you speak. Barnabas, use your head. Well, it's just he seemed interested in legends. Like you. I, I thought you might get along. How did he... You know my spear just by looking at it? You're more than some simple pilgrim. All things in Delphi are more than they appear. Even I. My name is Herodotus. I'm a storyteller. Or I was. This war is forcing us all to new extremes. <laughs> that much is true. Why are you hiding your identity? I'm here on behalf of a man in Athens. A very powerful man. We intend to finally end this war. You told me you came to ask the Oracle a personal question. War is personal, Barnabas. So, you came to seek the Pythia's guidance on how to end the war? I did. Though something is wrong in Delphi. Guards at every turn, people being turned away. don't seem convinced the Pythia can be believed. What did she tell you? I asked her to show the path to the war's end. She said, Spring should not wish for winter, as it brings death with it. Such wisdom! I don't understand These are the some wise words here. She's in there, and we're out here. I know a threat when I hear one. <laughs> You were on Kefalonia for too long. Why is this line up so long? This line is ridiculous. Are there always this many people to see the Pythia? These are more than just people. Every city sends a Fiori or sacred ambassadors to seek guidance on behalf of their people. The Pythia not only shapes the destinies of individuals, but of the entire Greek world. Imagine what power one would have if they controlled what came out of her mouth. Apollo controls this. Of course he does. Uh, why so much security? Death is nothing like they say. Has it always been like this? No. This was once an open and welcoming place. But war changes things. People seek out the Pythia for more political reasons. Prophecies in times of war often stir violent emotions. It's wise to keep your blades sheathed. Drawing blood in Delphi is considered an insult to Apollo. Punishment is severe. Uh, I have questions for them. I have my own questions for the Pythia. But this line... I'll be an old man by the time I see her. <laughs> You're joking! You carry more blades than a field of grass! 
I didn't come here to start trouble. Trouble? Just walk in! Who's going to stop you? The priest! <laughs> All right. Uh -uh. But if things get out of hand, I'm blaming you, Varnavas. Is he not every bit as great as I said? <laughs> I'm here to see the Pythia. Only those chosen by the light of Apollo may enter. How does one get chosen? One goes to the back of the line. Do I look like someone who waits in line? Haha, <laughs> that worked. Choose your question wisely, mortal, for you have but one. Speak, truth seeker. Ah, oh, shit. So we can either ask, where is my mother or who is my father? Right, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to go for the where is my mother option, because that way we can probably ask, um, ask her who the I father is. My mother. I have to find her. Where is she? It's you! From the visions! The child on the mountain! How could you know that? You need to leave. Now. Leave? Do you have any idea what I've been through to get here? Oh, but I do. There is wisdom in your decisions. Any other Mystios would have killed those people in that cave in Megaris. But you held back for the truth and balanced judgment with their lives. But... How? Oh. No one can hide from the light. Please. I've come this far. You must have the answers I seek. Child of the mountain. The cult of Cosmos have eyes everywhere. They will kill you. Cult of Cosmos? The Oracle has spoken. The prophecy is yours. You never answered my question! The Pythia is done for the day. I'm not leaving until I get answers. Oh dear. Rotatos, you're still here. Where's Varnavas? He's gone back to your ship. You don't look happy with your prophecy. She knew who I was. <laughs> She's the Pythia. It's her business to act like she knows you. That was no act. She said she had visions of me as a child on a mountain. What child hasn't stood on a mountain? I was thrown from that mountain. My life started and ended on that mountain. I'm telling you, she knew who I was, what I'd done. Tried to warn me. Warn you? About what? The Cult of Cosmos. She mentioned the Cult of Cosmos. Does this mean anything to you? Oh, shit. I heard whispers. A cult unlike any other coming to their feet. But I paid them no mind. The Pythia seemed afraid of them. Guards took her away. Took her away? Then the whispers were true. If this cult has corrupted the Pythia... This is devastating news. Do you understand what this means? Through her, the cult controls the world. I need to speak with her. When she's... Not so well protected. That would require a miracle from the gods. She is always protected. Hmm. Where can I find you her? You know more about the Pythia than I do. Where would she be? When she's not in the temple of Apollo, she's at her home in the Hora of Delphi. I can't go breaking down every door until I find her. The Oracle's home is probably easy enough to spot. She'd be the only person in the Hora of Delphi who can afford to live in luxury. But what does luxury look like? Where in the Hora of Delphi does the Pythia live? I've heard she lives on the outskirts of the village, but be warned, she will be guarded. Not everyone comes to see the Oracle with the best of intentions. 
I'll find where the Pythia lives. And I will get answers. Alexios, don't forget. Brute force is useless when finesse is required. Right, we need to be stealthy by the sounds of that. Uh, so we have a couple of missions over here. Let's take a look at our quest log. The truth will out. Um, do we over here have a blacksmith? We do indeed. Let's go and visit them. Level up. Yes. Uh, let's jump over here. There we go. Right, blacksmith, make my armor good. Alright, that's that upgraded. Upgrade this. Uh, so this one's actually really good, so we'll get this. Can't upgrade it. Oh my gosh, that's expensive. Uh... I can grab that one and upgrade that. Um, because we can save up to upgrade that one later. Uh, have we got... Uh, plus 6% total armor would be useful. There we go. If I can help you again, let me know. Um, so we're swapping out our arm for that. Um, we didn't upgrade our bow. We should probably do that as well. How may I help you? Perfect. May the blessings of Hermes go with you. Uh, so we need to go to the Horror of Delphi. Ah, oh, shit. We got a mercenary over there, though. Uh, whereabouts is Horsey? Here he is. Come on, come on. Let's go to the marker then. Right, we're here at the uh, Court of Delphi. Oh yeah, that is, is hiding inside. Obvious. Get some answers. Oh, we got a mercenary right next to her though. I need to That's a lot of protection for the Pythia. Uh, I'm guessing up the side of the building would probably be best. I don't know. I can stealth attack this guy. Yeah. 
That's our mercenary we need to kill. Oh shit, shit, shit. Run, run, run. That didn't go well. Hang on, get up. Okay, I can't do that apparently. Can I now? How do I become anonymous? How can I help you? Come back anytime. Here we go. No! Guards! I'm not here to hurt you. I just want answers. The Pythia is a sacred vessel of the gods. People travel the world for my answers. But none of them would dare break into my home. Apollo's wrath will be cruel and swift. Guards! Uh, I'm the one you should be afraid of. Enough with your lies. Tell me what I want to know. Can't breathe. If you raise your voice, if you tell a lie, I will cut your throat. I'm dead already. They'll find out you were here, and they'll kill me for it. Who? This cult of Cosmos? Speak! Yes, the cult wants you dead. They know you're here. Oh, we're gonna have to save her. What is this cult of Cosmos? They are the eyes that see, but go unseen. Enough with the riddles. I want names. I don't know. I swear. They hide behind masks and shrouds. Why would you work for the cult? I have no choice. So, all those prophecies from the gods, all those people, you're paid to deceive them all? Most want to know about love or death. I tell them what they want to hear. But when people want to know about war or politics, I'm paid very well to tell them what the cult wants them to hear. You said you saw me in your visions. What did you see? There is an artifact under the temple of Apollo. It reveals what only the gods should know. You called me the child on the mountain. The cult hunts a Spartan child who survived the terrible fall from Mount Taietos. The artifact revealed that child to be you. You have an opportunity to do the right thing. Tell me where to find the cult. Tell me where they are, or we'll go find them together. Beneath the Temple of Apollo, there is an ancient chamber. I think they meet there. But without one of their cloaks and masks, you won't make it more than two steps inside. Where can I find one of these cloaks and masks? There is a man. He visits me from time to time, makes sure I'm well taken care of. I have the biggest house in the Hora of Delphi, yet he still offers Drachmi for my troubles. 
gives me the creeps. What's his name? Elpinor. Elpinor? He's with the cult? I can't be sure. But if he is, he would definitely have what you require. Any idea where I can find him? There is a fort just south of the Valley of the Nymph. He's been known to conduct business there. You've been helpful. Now get out of my house! I should tell Irodotos what the Pythia told me about the cult. Maybe he'll have some insight. Ah! Uh, we could probably make our way around here. <laughs> Dealt with. Uh, there is some more treasure somewhere. I'm going to take a look for that. Here it is. And that's that place done. Cosmos is hunting me, but I'm going to hunt them first. She told me they meet in a secret chamber under the Temple of Apollo. So it's all true. If the cult has done anything, it's fooled this old man. I can't get in without a mask and cloak. It's how the cultists identify each other. The Temple of Apollo is by the cave of Yea. Simple enough to find. But a cultist's mask and cloak? How will you accomplish that? The Pythia gave me the only clue I need. When I'm ready, I'll meet you at the temple. For now, I'm going to kill Elpinor, Malaka's liar. <laughs> I don't. Oh! Ah, there it is. Oh, I gotta use. There we go. There we go. Uh, right, so that is going to do it for today's episode, I think. Um, I don't actually know how long we've been recording for. I think we've been recording for quite a while. Um, so, thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, be sure to leave a like, comment down below and subscribe. And if you want to help support the channel, hit that join button. It means the world to me. And I will see you in the next one. Goodbye.